Hi, this is Joanne Allenby. I'm the editor of Pork Network, and I'm here at the 2013 World Pork Expo. I'm standing here with Dr. Gwendolyn Jones, who is the technical services manager for Denisco, which is part of DuPont. So Gwen, lots of changes in the pork industry. Tell me about some of the challenges that producers are facing in the pork industry. Challenges are becoming the same all over the world, really. And the big thing is um, people are battling with regulations. Regulations are becoming more and more tight. And the other thing is um, the high volatility in raw material prices. Uh, so, okay, how can you remain your free cost? How can it stay at a low cost? And then also if you're using the alternative ingredients, there are a lot more variable in nutrient content. Um, so how can you manage that without um, reducing the quality of pork and the, and the pig performance? So Gwen, tell us some of the things that DuPont is doing to, to meet these challenges and help producers deal with these challenges. Today, we're really committed to helping to contribute to the food security all over the world. We're now about 60% of our research budget is going towards uh, increasing food production. So it shows the commitment of the pond, I think, to, to agriculture um, and having all these scientists all around the world finding solutions. So it's giving confidence that we will be able to find solutions. Wonderful. Well, we appreciate everything that you're doing. And we're going to bring in Dave Hall, who is the key account business development manager for Denisco. And Dave, producers are having some of the highest feed prices that they've ever had in the U.S. What is DuPont doing to help producers deal with these, with these prices and, and with their feed costs? Well, at DuPont, we have uh, one specific product, Phytase, and our brand is Phyzyme. That product actually helps producers reduce nursery feed costs, where we can reduce feed costs by 50 cents a pig. Now, that may not sound like a lot to the norm, but 50 cents in this kind of market, where most producers dream of $5 a pig, you're talking about 10% of their net margin on the last 10 years of profits. So this 50 cent a pig feed cost reduction, it's a very large number that we have, we've now taken number one market share in the globe on our Fizine product. So much so that we're now expanding a key production plant here in Iowa at Cedar Rapids. Juncture, that Phytase has produced over two pounds exit weight in the nursery and five points of feed efficiency. So the 50 cent cost feed cost reduction is the feed cost number, but the extra two pounds of nursery weight is even more valuable, and that's not even counted in the 50 cent feed cost. We've really got to get this message more to the producer level that how consistent this is, the quality of our product. And now DuPont, in the, in the last three years, Denisco was the company that produced these phytases. Now with DuPont, we're increasing our global reach. We're expanding our plants here in the U.S. and abroad. And I really look towards a large presence that DuPont no longer will be thought of as the more traditional way of carpets, of paints, of other parts. Our CEO has talked about sustainable agriculture feeding the world. And our enzyme production and lowering pig feed cost is one of these key ways which we think we can help the producer today. Well, 50 cents a pig is very significant and it sounds like we've got a chance to address one of the major challenges for producers. Dave, thank you so much for joining us. Thank you.